What's good guys? This story came out on March the 30th. It's coming out of Fripp Island, South Carolina. And it's coming via Newsweek. And thanks again to Marie722 for sending it to me. May in charge with molesting alligator after alarming image circles the internet. A photo posted to Facebook by South Carolina's Fripp Island Golf and Beach Resort is drawing attention online due to the dangerous and strange act it depicts. In the picture, one man crouches near the ground and appears to drag a large alligator out of a body of water by its tail. Meanwhile, another person stands in the background taking a photo of the man's antics. The resort made a statement along with the photo. Fripp Island Resort would like to remind all of our residents, guests, and visitors that Fripp is a wildlife habitat. Harassment, enticement, or feeding of wildlife is both illegal and dangerous. We are sharing this incident in hopes that the violators will be found not to encourage this behavior. They also noted that the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources had been contacted and was investigating the photo. Now here is a picture of the photo. You see the man behind with the camera taking pictures of the guy trying to pull the alligator by its tail. Now I'm going to zoom in. Look how large that alligator is. Some people just don't have the sense God gave them. And then look at this guy over here. You can tell by his uh, demeanor in the photo that he's scared. Now I'm very familiar with Fripp Island. I've uh, been there many times. It's a very affluent uh, place. It's right next to Hilton Head Island, which is where I'm more familiar with. Uh, my grandparents were married in Beaufort. And um, my grandpa was a Marine on Paris Island, which is right next to Beaufort. All in that same little area there. And this area is very, um, very much a wildlife area kind of place. You will see this on the regular. This is not something that's abnormal. Since the image was first shared on March the 27th, the state has reported that the man featured in the photo has been identified and will be charged for the crime. Specifically, the man will be charged with molesting an alligator, a misdemeanor that can include a fine or up to 30 days in prison. David Luke is a spokesperson for the SCDRNR spoke out about the incident. It's against the law, and this guy's going to pay a pretty hefty price, he said. But the safety issue is so much more serious than that. You could lose your life. Hundreds of comments appeared under Fripp Island's Resort's Facebook post, expressing shock and disappointment in the man's highly dangerous behavior. Not sure what that dude was thinking. That's a rather large one, noted one user. Oh my gosh, like, what is his plan? Did he lose his golf ball too? Asked another. As the Fripp Island Resort noted in their post, harassing an alligator is, quote, both illegal and highly dangerous, end quote, and it's an action that often comes with dire consequences. Alligators are fast, volatile creatures that are known to attack when they're provoked, and even sometimes when they're not. Their attacks can cause serious injuries and even death. Thankfully, no injuries have been reported in relation to this particular instance at the Fripp Island Resort, Ideally, this man's charges will serve as a lesson to future guests at the resort and discourage others from attempting the same behavior. That's also another large alligator. Um, I mean, I, I can't even... It makes me wonder, like, what was going through his brain at that time? I mean, some people seriously don't have the sense God gave them. I'm going to end the video on that note. But thanks for watching, guys. 